The first time I, I saw Ricky was when my dad was on the computer and he found out on Facebook that the Rescue League had Ricky up for adoption. So I went over to my father's computer and I saw how cute she was and she was just adorable. I could tell from the video that she had something wrong with her first front legs. She has an angular limb deformity, so when she walks, her two little front paws don't look the same as her hind ones. I told my parents that she was adorable and I would love to meet her and maybe someday adopt her. I came home from school one day and discovered that Ricky was already at my house for a trial adoption. The trial we had Ricky for before we adopted her was for two days. Within one hour, I wanted to adopt her right away. I always wanted a chihuahua, and this chihuahua was very friendly and sweet and cute. Most people would want dogs that all walked on four legs and looked completely normal, but Ricky is normal, and she has no clue that she's not like other dogs. I never had any doubt, even when I first saw Ricky, that I would end up not wanting her. A lot of times when I play with Ricky, one of the games we play is usually I chase her around and then she just runs hysterically all around the room. And some other times when she has a little stuffed animal with her she plays with, I try to steal a stuffed animal and she jumps up in the air and tries to get it back. I usually go outside when it's time for her to do her business and swing on the swing set and then she comes over to me and starts licking me. Playing with Ricky is very fun, but a lot of the stuff we do also is giving her baths once in a while because she does get into trouble sometimes and get a little dirty. And of course I have to feed her and to give her a heartworm medicine every month. It doesn't seem like a chore to me, it just um, seems like taking care of my own child or something, but Ricky's a dog, not a child. One of the activities I do with Ricky is when it's not so hot out, Ricky is one of those types of dogs that does not mind wearing dog clothing. So you buy her a lot of little dog outfits and dresses and stuff and she just wears them all the time and she doesn't care. It's very fun to dress Ricky. It's just like dressing a doll, although a dog gets alive. Ricky usually sleeps with me, either on the floor when I am in my bed, or sometimes I'll sleep if she's like scared or something, because she gets scared a lot by herself. I'll come down and sleep on the floor with her and then she goes right to sleep. I know most people would just want a dog that looks normal and everything, but I don't really care how Ricky walks or how she is. It's just that she's so sweet and she needed a home and she's wonderful. And I wouldn't trade her for any other dog.